on November 5th, 2008. November 5th, 2008. Who remembers what happened the day before on November 4th, 2008? Obama got elected Obama had just and I become got elected. a job the next day in okay. college. So yeah. wait, that November 5th was your first job day? Yeah. So that was the day I was, it was if, if you were here in New York, you remember, it was beautiful outside. It was clear skies, probably a crisp 65 degrees, and I was walking a Greyhound old ass greyhound, probably 16 years old, and we walked past this Maltese, this woman's walking her Maltese puppy, she's kind of on her phone, uh, and the dog I'm walking kills it. <laughs> <laughs> I did not expect the story to uh, kills it. take this murderous turn. It was the most <laughs> fucking insane moment. Because Truly a dog eat dog world, well, god like, damn. Yeah. It was like, yeah, it was like symbolism. <laughs> like old and had like a gimpy paw they rescued it from the racing circuit yeah and it was like one of its eyes was really bad so it couldn't see and this little puppy was just like jumping up on it and like you know and i remember the woman had like a, a retractable leash you know what i'm talking about right right, right. so you she kind of she kept, kind of kept walking but it let the you know the, the and this dog was so small it kind of had to like fight the strength of the leash, yeah, you know, and, which is not strong at all. But and, and then she got, got in the dog just the greyhound just looked at it, it was like, what? and just took it and it was just like in a matter of seconds, like blood's flying, I'm like what the fuck? And I'm like, I have the dog by its by, but I, I have its jaws. I'm trying to pry it open. Yeah, but you, I felt the dog's jaw lock, which is I, there's nothing you can yeah. do. And luckily, are pretty and too. I always say this. There was a construction worker who saved the day. This happened in Soho on Broom Street, by the, also, by the way. And this construction worker, who was, there was no construction site around. <laughs> he was an angel. Like, he just appeared, like, from another dimension or another reality. Like, oh, fuck, I gotta go stop this. And he just, and he, with his hard hat, started slapping the Greyhound on the ass. Right. Till it finally yelped and then and dropped the this dead. Right. I mean, dead. And, and but because the leash just started going. Zzz, yeah. like, <laughs> <laughs> that poor. I mean, I feel so bad for that woman who owned that dog. I feel so bad. Okay, like, now you. She was cool about it. Like she clearly understood it wasn't my fault. Yeah. But it was like, I. But you're being real nice, lady. You should hit me. I'll tell you. Can hit me. <laughs> and she fucking then she called the cops and the cops showed up and I was like yeah that makes sense but they were like the dog didn't uh what did it show it didn't bite the didn't hit but didn't bite the person <laughs> all right good luck <laughs> <laughs> wait one yeah, minute like I called the dog police for that one that's not our uh, department <laughs> what do we look, 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 look like the dog police and you wanna, <laughs> well if you didn't watch such thing as a dog police it would look like this <laughs> but. Holy shit. Yeah, I felt bad for her. She I hope I hope she is just surrounded by puppies every day for the rest of her life. Because that was fucking brutal. So 